the first cut, I was gagging the best campaign I did. I swear to God, I kid you not, this is so fire. They are going to faint when they see our It's just too good. And I'm so happy to be a part of it. I have no notes. Eight. What is up, OGs? If y'all reading by the title, and if y'all follow me on Instagram and all motherfucking platforms, and I'm pretty sure y'all already know what the is going on and what this video is about to consist of. Y'all understand, like, I am so freaking hype, and I've literally been literally counting down the days until today. And I'm just, oh, I'm just so excited. I'm just so happy. So on Instagram, on my Instagram stories, on January 31st, I posted Mark, today's date on when I'm filming this, and then we're gonna revisit it in a couple of months. So it is January 31st, and I just want y'all to jot down this date, write it down, baby, January 31st, so that in a few months, y'all can revert back to this day, and y'all can see what I'm talking about. So, this is what your girl's referring to. On January 31st of this year, 2024, is when we did our freaking campaign shoot for this collaboration. And, oh, I'm just. Hey y'all, it is January 31st, and we are on turned it up so I got a couple of questions that you guys want to know and want to learn about this whole collaboration so I'm gonna answer it for y'all so January 1st well no January 31st was the actual day of the campaign shoot and when I tell y'all it was a long day which I was a hundred percent prepared for like I was literally counting down the days until the campaign shoot because I was just literally thinking about that day every single day until it happened because I'm like okay once this, I literally kept thinking in my head, once this shoot, once this campaign is done, it's literally, it's a wrap, it's, it's it. It's literally about to happen, it's literally about to launch soon. It's gonna be behind, the campaign is gonna be behind, and all we gotta kind of prepare for is like the lunch, the marketing, and all of that. So, the whole shoot day, y'all, it was a long, long day. The production, baby, my team, we literally hired a production team for this whole rollout, this whole campaign shoot, and it was like, Baby, this is literally a campaign, a real, 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 a real freaking shoot. Like, we hired a production team who usually kind of pr produces and does production for video shoots and movies. So, this production team was literally like top tier, baby. So, the whole shoot, the whole campaign, the whole day literally ran smooth. It was a long day. We literally started like 8 a.m. all the way up until the night. 8 p.m. 9 p.m. but the shoot in general y'all it was real smooth it was real easy it was so much fun and it was just it was just amazing to see everything we've literally been working on for so long coming to life <sighs> my literally first campaign ever especially for my brand like 
But overall, y'all, the shoot was amazing. The campaign, the whole day went great. my brand when I first like when I literally just thought of like my brand as an idea when my brand was literally an idea I knew eventually I would get into the whole idea of doing collaborations with people whether that was influencers artists no matter what it was I knew that I was gonna be doing collaborations and I knew from day one my first 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 ever collaboration when it came to L-R-V-A-E I wanted to be J-T but since I've known since day one I wanted to collab with JT, I knew JT was someone I wanted to collab with because she is just somebody who's unapologetically herself and I feel like that's me all around and she's just someone I've literally been following and literally been supporting since day one and vice versa. She's literally been following me and supporting your girl since day one and so just to see both, both of our growth, see her growth, I knew for a fact I wanted to collaborate her. She's the one who's unapologetically herself. She's literally a boss. She's literally like a bad ass. And I know she's also a person who doesn't mind stepping outside her comfort zone, stepping outside of the box, just like me as well. So, and she is a part of the culture. So that is like the main reasons why I wanted JT to be my number one and first ever collaboration. And how could I forget y'all? She's literally a fire sign, so we we. Okay, y'all, so we're going to rewind back and so y'all can see the first ever time we've ever met on Zoom for this whole collaboration. But this collaboration has literally been a thought since 2022. And so when I brought the idea to my team, when I decided that, you know, it's time that we're about to do a collaboration, I want to do it for our two-year anniversary for Lord Bay. I literally took it to my team and we've kind of been planning and prepping to kind of approach her team since 2022, but our first ever meeting was Jane, June 2023, and y'all see that clip. All right, you guys, so it is Tuesday, June 20th, 2023, at three o'clock p.m., and I know you guys are probably wondering, by the time y'all are watching this, it is literally a whole year has passed, months has passed, and when y'all are watching, it will be 2024. That is so crazy, thinking right now, in this present time, I am sitting Today, it is 2023, and when y'all are watching this, it will be 2024, insane. But I'm about to get ready to hop on a call, a Zoom meeting, because today is the first ever meeting for Laura Bay's first collab, which is gonna be with JT. So we're so excited. So I gotta join y'all because it's three o'clock now, and the meeting is at three o'clock. So let's get on. Thank you guys for joining us. Hey. I just see your baby so pretty. <laughs> Thank you, girl. Thank you all for joining the call. I'm super, super excited about this. Like, y'all understand, I'm so excited. But for the people on the call I'm who I'm excited. Yes, I'm so excited, girl. But for the people on the call who may not um, know who I am, my name is De'Ara Taylor. Um, like Tara mentioned, the CEO and the founder of Lord Bay. And Lord Bay is that I wear brand, which is my dear passion because I love sunglasses. I love all things shades that, that go on my face. So um, that's pretty much the sum it up. Laura Bay launched April 17th, which is my birthday, the year of 2022. But a lot of people think it's older because you know we've done so much, my team, me, everyone who's put in the hand of uh, making Laura Bay grow as big as it is today. You know, this is pretty much our first ever collab with someone. And I know the first person that was on my list was you, JT. So I'm so excited you agreed to this and I'm so excited Thank for this you. Of course, I agree. <laughs> and I know we met one time when we worked on the shoot for or Summer, Summer Walker. Mm -hmm. So this is pretty much the first time we ever met. So, but this, I am super, super excited for you to be joining on and collaborating. So I'll let Tara. And I feel like both of our styles Yes, and that's a, that is the main reason too why I was like JT so, for sure. Because so good. the number one thing people always say is that like, they think we look alike or we have similar features. Yeah, so yeah. 
Yeah, I'm excited. They're gonna love it. They are. They are. It's gonna. It's gonna be. It's gonna be big. It's. It's definitely gonna be talked about everywhere because this is something that feels like her. It feels authentic. Like it's not forced. It's not being forced onto us. Like both you and um, the R, you guys are fire signs. So that's kind of like the idea of saying like you guys are twin flames. So the number one thing that inspired this project and this collaboration was to pretty much show people that women, but not only women, women of color can come together for a greater cause and a bigger purpose and join forces and like make magic. And another reason would be, well, this is not necessarily a reason, but I know it's this whole notion that I don't like to collab, I don't collab, but that's not the case. For me, when it comes to collaborations, I want to, I think bigger, I think bigger than just content you know what I'm saying and it's been this whole thing where my supporters JT supporters our supporters as a whole has literally been manifesting this thing since we've literally been on the scene and I like things that are organic I like things that make sense and that is kind of like the reason and I think this whole collaboration was something that wasn't thrown together it didn't just happen immediately it didn't just come about randomly it was something that literally has been a thought like i've said jt has literally been the person that i said i wanted to collab with for my brand since day one and i think that it was just organic and i think the time timing was just impeccable i feel like when the time is right it'll happen and i feel like this was the time this was the time to do this collaboration for my brand, for her, for me, for the both of us to just join forces. I think my supporters would love, when I say love, baby, I mean love this collaboration. I already know. I'm filming this video ahead of time, so I'm already predicting that one we selling out, that's number one, baby. That's like this. But I think the I think the supporters is gonna love this collaboration because the supporters are also someone who's had a freaking hand in this whole thing as somebody who's literally had a say in this because I can pop up multiple, multiple tweets and multiple comments over time, over the, over the past few years saying that me and JT's a collab and y'all manifest it. <laughs> Baby! One thing I can say as to why this collaboration sets us apart from any collaboration in general and any collaboration in the same field or in the same range is because number one, top, 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 top thing will be the culture. I don't think nobody can do it like us, if you know what I mean. And don't get me wrong because I have supporters all over the world and I love all of my supporters no matter the ethnicity, no matter the different cultures that everybody, you know, represent. However, when your girl walk in the room, I am who I am. And that's who I'm always gonna represent. And when I think of my culture, when I think of my people, everything literally is just chef kisses, unique one of a kind, cannot be beat, and it's just, it's just natural. And I mean, <laughs> what more can I say? And I think the biggest thing, like I said, the biggest thing that sets this collaboration apart from any other collaboration is, and one thing about it, we can be imitated, but we can never, and I mean never, be duplicated. Like, can't nobody, can't nobody, do us better than us and can't nobody do me better than me and can't nobody do JT better than JT like come on man but hey I can go on and on and on but don't take my word for it it shows
And the last thing I would say that really, really just sets us apart is that we're the blueprint. And when you're the blueprint, you don't have nowhere else to look. You're not looking nowhere else. It's all within your creative mind. And it just comes organically and naturally. Like everything, the style, the sass, the attitude, the spice, it's within. So the whole process of this collaboration was extremely easy actually i already knew what i wanted to do when it came to this collaboration and the thing the whole idea was twin them because people always say like we have features or we look alike or we have the same style or whatever the case may be because we do and it was easy because i knew whatever i love jt would love and i knew whatever she loved i would love so that's what made it easy honestly and the whole idea, like I said, was twin them. I took it back to my team and then we kind of came back and we kind of agreed on this whole twin flame thing because flame, remember what I said at the beginning, we both fire signs, she is Sagittarius, your girl is an Aries. And so I was like, there it is, twin them, twin flame. Mm. Honestly, I don't think there was like any real challenges. I think the one challenge there was was kind of deciding on what JT picks was gonna be and what my picks was gonna be. Cause like I said, we like literally have similar tastes, literally if not the same exact taste of things and styles. So that probably was like the only challenge. Challenge, <laughs> yeah. I think with this collaboration, it just shows that it's no limits to Lorve. And we are so unpredictable. And with this being just our two year anniversary, and our first ever collaboration is with none other than JT. Baby, the sky's the limit and who knows what's to come. So y'all will see the whole behind the scenes of this shoot, kind of like I said, the day one from the first meeting all the way up until shoot day, the whole campaign. It is January 31st and today is actually shoot day. <laughs> Your girl is super freaking excited. Call time was 8.15. But I had to be a little, I had to arrive a little later because y'all woke up to no hot water. And I'm like, baby, you think I'm gonna go to my shoot and not take a shower? Please. So I had to, you know, get that situated, get in the shower. Like I said, I took my soul in. <laughs> y'all, look at me. I took my soul in out so that I can get my wig on. So all she has to do, I left the braids in, so all she has to do is just braid this little, my little leave out part down. So I am ready to go, y'all. So we about to end. Another reason why I really wasn't tripping about, you know, getting in the shower and all that and waiting was because the where the location where the shoot is today is two minutes away from here, y'all. Two minutes. So we is good to go. But I am super excited. I'm all, I'm pretty sure, I'm 100% sure that like production and everybody is already working. It's about to be a movie, y'all. We supposed to have fire. We, we got a whole production scene for this. So it's about to be lit. L-O-R-B-A-E-X times. JT, let's get it. It's about to be a movie. Hi, friends. Hey, friends. Hey, like a 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 Get chipped like Sakato, send a wave through the hood, now I'm sounding like Verado. Why you eat bread with avocado? We be trying to die shells before I land in our tomato. Hey guys, my name is Amy. I am the makeup artist for Dear today. This is our third shoot for Lord Bay. And we did her signature look. We did a little brown smoky eye on the eyes. We did the feline liner where it comes in and it comes out. And we did a nude lip with a little pink in the middle. And an overline lip for sure in chestnut from MAC. Following you? Yeah, yeah. So we're gonna start okay. you like right here. Okay. And we're gonna follow you from behind. So we're gonna start low and then come up. So it's literally gonna walk to the screen space right here. So I'm walking directly to this green mark. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And when you get here, you're gonna look over your left shoulder. Is it easy Would it for her to go reverse? Hold my leg. Hold your leg. Uh, he stood right here and showed me myself. I said, that's what I like. She is up now. For special effects, nice to meet you guys. Be safe. Any questions, ask us. It is. Definitely, it's cold out there, so it feels good in here. 
Alright, we're, we're rolling! rolling. We're rolling. Alright, let's switch. Switch. Let's go. It is hot. Back, so back. Back. It's almost out. It's almost out. Okay, so you guys. Wait, you don't be talking like that on your YouTube channel. Uh-uh, I'll be like, where the OGs? <laughs> it's your girl OGD. We out here on set at L O R B A E X J. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my that god. That looks sick. Oh my god. Oh. Holy Ooh. shit. <laughs> That's on. sick. Come here. <laughs> Replicate this set with JT and basically we're gonna create a new vision. Um, so yeah, so that's what we're doing. Back in that bag again. Whoa, whoa, yeah, yeah. Hey, 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 hey. Back in that, yeah. Tell them to watch it. Now I ain't talking my pockets. Just know we ain't running out the way that we stock it. If I got it, you got it. If I call it, she slide and tell her to mop it. Yeah, I got that. Dawn. Damn, she took that thing off and bring it around Going at it till I'm on Put that nani in a hole, I'm beating it down I'm back in that bag again Oh, 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 say less I'm back in that bag again Yeah, yeah, oh, say less I'm back in that, yeah What you doing? Yeah, yeah, I'm back in that Hey, where you going? Hey, hey, back in that bag again Hey, I'm Marvin and I'm on set with Nove Hey, I'm Marvin and I'm on set with Nove
said, y'all, it was just an amazing time. It was just such a great shoot. The whole, the team, everybody, the production team, my whole team, JT's team, JT in general, every single, everybody from the photographers, from the videographers, from the makeup artists to the nail tech, from literally everybody on the stylist, everybody on set and everybody that came together and to like literally bring this idea to life. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I cannot say thank you enough. Like we literally did it. And also another thing I wanted to point out to y'all, what was so funny on set that literally everybody kept getting us mixed up. Nobody literally could tell us apart, especially when we had on our robes and we were walking around like during lunchtime or when we were changing during the out sets where we had to put on robes and kind of like just had like really literally where we just had our hair y'all and just literally robe on people would literally get us confused and sometimes when i'm watching back on these clips i'm literally like who's who so my goal for this whole project and this collaboration after the lunch is to basically to inspire the girlies give the girlies something to look at and be like baby y'all killed it and so can i and another reason will obviously be to show why Loave is and will forever be a one on one. No balls. How you feeling, Jay? I'm tired, but I'm so excited for one of the It's a mother. <laughs> so I hope you all enjoyed this whole sit down and this kind of like insight on how this collaboration came about and just all the little pieces on what it was to create this project. It was such a dream come true. I literally had an amazing time and I'm just so, so happy with how everything came out and just shout out and much love to my girl JT girl. I love you so much. And we did that. Remember what we said? Can't nobody do it like us. And I know y'all was probably wondering, obviously the pair of shades I was wearing is from our collection, L-O-R-V-A-E, Love X J T. And this pair is called Riz, R-I-Z-Z. The baddest, not you. Beefing with who, not you. 